Welcome to Higher Ed. In this series, you'll hear from professionals working in some of LA's hottest emerging industries, high demand, good wages, and the education to get there. Hi, my name is Todd Wynn, and I work at WSP as a transportation planner working on the California High Speed Rail Project. Here in Southern California, we have a lot of traffic, so wherever you see or go, you see traffic. And the California High Speed Rail System is our solution to that, which is a bullet train that travels over 200 miles per hour all the way from Sacramento down to San Diego, which you can travel in less than three hours. A transmission planner is all about helping people move from one place to another, really kind of making that vision happen for you to get to places. As a transportation planner, I really end up splitting my time between working independently with myself as well as a team. A lot of the technical analysis, of course, is done probably more independently just to be able to mine through a lot of data. I would say the best part of my day is really collaborating with all different types of disciplines, everything from archaeologists, bio biologists, architects, and of course, engineers. You know, we really have to work together to be able to solve one of Southern California's largest issues, and that's of course, transportation. My education pathway began when I was went to community college at Santa Monica College, where I really focused my time on the core classes and the curriculum. Luckily, I was able to transfer out of that program and go to the University of Southern California, where I was able to do a double major in both urban planning and architecture. So after graduation, I really want to apply myself in transportation planning. A good fit for a transportation planner would be a variety of things. You know, are you a really good writer? Can you speak eloquently? Another one might be science and math. Are you interested in calculations? You know, do different design work for engineering for bridges and roads and trains. What the California High Speed Rail Project means to me is really making change in my own community, my hometown, everything that I've lived, learned, and bred into. And so it's really exciting to be able to make that change and make that impact so that I can travel to San Francisco in less than three hours or go to San Diego in half the time. So it's really exciting for me to be a part of all of that. My name is David Seastead. I'm an aircraft mechanic for MX Aero Global LLC. We do general aviation. We're actually partnered with a flight school. So they do initial flight training and we maintain their aircraft as well as outside customers who own similar aircraft. Something people may not know about aircraft maintenance is that it's not like your car where you take it to the shop only when it's broken down. There's actually FAA requirements to have your plane worked on at regular intervals. So on small aircraft, you often have one mechanic working on the whole plane. So you take ownership of the job and you do it from start to finish. You're basically inspecting all the parts of the plane that the pilot doesn't normally see. We're tasked with meticulously searching the aircraft for potential problems and determining whether or not the aircraft is safe to fly. I've always been a car mechanic as a hobby. I just really liked working with my hands, so I was kind of in tension. I wanted to do that. When I discovered, actually, I had a friend and I just, who told me about why not work on aircraft, and it was like a light bulb went off. So the training to become an aircraft mechanic the program I went to was at Orange Coast College in Costa Mesa, and it was a two-year program. Take a test, they give you a certificate, and then you go and you take your FAA test to get your license. The FAA is the Federal Aviation Administration. They do the licensing for the mechanics, they do licensing for pilots, they do the registration for the aircraft. Written tests are computer-based, so you just sign up and take those. And then the oral and practical is probably like an eight-hour event. After you graduate from the program, many trade schools have job placement, people on site where they help you find a job. I found a flight school that I just walked in, gave my resume and asked if they were hiring and uh, the rest is history. Well, aircraft maintenance is a pretty fulfilling career for me because I get to use my whole skill set. The pilots trust us to give them a safe plane to fly with their families. You know, it's not just about turning wrenches, you know, it's about contributing to the safety of aviation.